So what's like the most freaky thing you've ever done? What are your fetishes? Time's <laughs> up. <laughs> Next. Who wants this? Well, we're, we're Who wants a piece together. of this action right here? Oh yeah, they got the color on it. A little glittery. Yeah. I'm putting you on my... Have you ever been with two girls before? Okay, he has really soft hands. What do you think the chair and hotel rooms are actually for? Oh, he's going to wait. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> That's hurting me. So you've asked us what our body counts are. Ladies, what are your body counts? <laughs> Welcome to Shoot Your Shot. I am Thompson. Today I have a co-host. Hi, and I'm Alexis Fox. Nice yes. to meet everybody. Yes, and we have another victim today <laughs> on the show. Hi, Hi guys. Hello. Kylie. Hi, Kylie. Do you want to introduce, give us a little introduction, like who you are, et cetera. Yeah. Tell us okay. about yourself. Okay. Well, uh, to some people, I'm considered an adult star, even though I only did it for a year. However, I'm in like Brazzers, Naughty America, all like the big companies, and then I think one movie blew up and I became like a top 10 on Pornhub that year. Which oh, that's crazy. Wild. Nice. Yes. That's yes. crazy. So I think um, that's why I'm known wherever I go. We're all going to Google year. her later. <laughs> <laughs> but I feature dance. Um, I still have my OnlyFans. And, you know, you never know. I may go back into the adult industry again. And Ooh. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Brothers. <laughs> so you've been on a speed date before? I've never done a speed day. Never? Ever. Are I you more like a Bumble or a Tinder? You know, I've recently gone on one Bumble date a couple days ago and one time last year. How did that go? Actually, a few days ago went really well. He's really cute, really nice, very respectful, looking for a relationship. Wow. But really hot. Like he has a like, rocker look and Ooh. he's like, I'm not a player. I'm looking for a relationship. Oh, so. nice. Nice. We'll see. Ooh. However, he doesn't know about Kylie. <laughs> oh, you haven't yes. told him yet? <laughs> no. How, how do you approach that? How do you tell yeah, them? Yeah, how do you approach it? Like, do you yeah. wait a certain amount of days before you say something? Or Yes. I okay. feel like they need to earn it. So if they've taken me on, like, at least three, four dates, and I'm feeling like this could maybe go somewhere, maybe exclusive, and I really like the guy. Otherwise, they really don't need to know. <laughs> how do they normally take it? Is it like mixed well, reactions? The last one didn't take it so good from last year. He, would, he got very insecure oh. and a little uh, very jealous. And I think that's probably why that didn't work out because he has these jealousy trust issues. And yeah, it, that's not good. And then he's like, oh, so do you go fuck people for $20,000? And I'm like... <laughs> Oh, wow. Do I have my <laughs> ring on my finger? Like, <laughs> where's the house in my name? <laughs> right. I guess I'm free to do technically whatever I want to do. So how's the dating scene out in Vegas? How's it been for you? I really don't date a lot. Oh, really? So they're lucky if I go on a date with them. This one rocker guy is very lucky. Mm. Well, maybe we find <laughs> another lucky one today. Yeah. Now you get to you go on several. Know. We never know. Should we bring out the first contestant? Sure. Let's do it. Let's bring him out and see what happens. Well, Come take a seat. Ring. Yeah, right in the middle. Here. Oh, this is for you. So you got to hold it up nice and close. So have you ever been on a speed date before? Yes. Oh, you have? Yeah. Where? Uh, you know, it's funny. The first one at uh, Big Jerks in uh, in Las Vegas. Oh, really? Well, man, this man's got experience. Uh, the experience? first one. How many wow. speed dates have you been on? One. Okay. <laughs> Just one and done. I did a favor for somebody. How was it? A favor? Fast. Did it, did it, <laughs> it was fast. <laughs> it just so it didn't work out? No. Okay. Tell me, did you date a lot of girls or it was like one girl? Uh, you stood with every girl like two minutes and they ask you all the questions and stuff. Yeah. And then, you know what I'm saying? At the end, uh, you exchange information if they liked you. So, you oh. know what I'm saying? That's how it works. Well, today you're going to have three minutes. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. All right. Let's get, let's get straight into it. Hi. So I'm Kylie. What's your name? Joseph. Nice to meet you. You too. What brings you out to the dating world? When was your last relationship? Uh, we broke up like a month ago. Oh, month ago. Mm -hmm. Interesting. How long was the relationship? Uh, probably like a year, a year and a half. Okay. What happened? She, she a cheater. Oh. You know, we in Vegas. It's hard to find somebody you know, loyal. That, that is true. It's, mm -hmm. it's hard to find loyalty. Um, so have you ever been with two girls before? Uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cause I like to have fun sometimes. Oh, me too. Do you have any questions for me? I thought you was asking oh, the question. No, you can ask questions. Ask well, can, away. I, where is your fantasy date? Like, where would you take, um, like, 
Yeah, what's your fantasy date? Fantasy date, I would have to say, you know what I'm saying? Candlelight dinner on the beach. Oh, that's romantic. In uh, Vegas? Sweet. No, no. The beach in Vegas? Hawaii. <laughs> Hawaii. Oh, <laughs> oh okay. There we go. There we go. Is that, that going to be our first date? You're going to take me to Hawaii? Me, we're going wherever you want to go. Ooh. First date. Oh, oh sweet okay, talker. So okay. what, do you, what do you do as a, for work, like your career? I am a marketer. So I do a lot of marketing and stuff like that. Okay. I'm very expensive. I make a lot of money. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see a Rolls Royce. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Not that much. <laughs> That's hilarious. Um, so what's your ideal type of woman? Like, what do you, what do you like? What do you normally attract it to? Funny. Like to have fun. Spontaneous. Got to be funny. You know what I'm saying? Adventurous. You know what I'm saying? And then a lady in the street. I mean, a freak in the bedroom, yeah. you know. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm, freaky. Interesting. So what's like the most freaky thing you've ever done? What are your fetishes? <laughs> oh, Time's up. that sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> Time's up. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Sorry, no, no. no, we want to hear <laughs> this. <laughs> I don't, it's, Oh, that's a hot seat. That's a hot seat, right? We in a hot yeah, seat. Yeah, I'm all uh, tuned in right now. Let's hear this. <laughs> hold on. All right. One more time. Repeat the question one more time so I can get it right. The freakiest thing? The freakiest thing you've done and what's your, fe- like, what's a fetish you like? Like, you've been to? No, something about them saying sucking it from the back. Like, it, it was, it was different. And you know, I mean, are you doing the second or who's doing no, the second? She, from the somebody back? else doing the second. <laughs> we need a little bit more details you on this. Details? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this is a real X I'm channel. I'm leaning over. We want details. <laughs> <laughs> man, that's details, something you do. Please. That's just something you, man. <laughs> that's just something that's X rated. <laughs> I think this, this is a, this is a, a PG channel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, time is up. Oh, oh, Save by the bell. Save by the bell. The bell. <laughs> All right, let's that's see. If, does anybody one, have? Right? Alexis, one. do you have a final question since you've been watching? What do you Ooh. have? Ah, final question. Yeah, you hmm. asked the final question. I thought it was four. But I, I'm, I'm still a little stuck on the fetish part <laughs> there a little bit. It definitely sounds pretty freaky. I like that. Um, what do you think the chair and hotel rooms are actually for? Ooh. In yeah. Vegas? No, in any hotel room you go, there's always that one chair. What do you think that one chair is really meant to be for? I like that question. <laughs> what I thought it was for? <laughs> <laughs> oh, when I'm, oh, when I'm thinking now. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take both. <laughs> well, I'm going to say, you know, to sit in and do your thinking, you know. That's what I thought it was for, you know. <laughs> but I guess... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess in Vegas it's used for a lot of riding. We're gonna say oh, I guess we're gonna say that. You're we're gonna go with that. <laughs> well, thanks for coming through. We'll let you All know. Right, we'll let you know if you're coming back out. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good question. <laughs> What is that chair for? It's called, it's known as the cuck chair. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Just I'm how, like, let's see. How freaky are we? <laughs> wow. Have you done that before? I yeah. feel like, okay, fair yeah. enough. Yeah. 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 <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. Did you tie the guy to the chair though? Or like, did you sit there and watch? It all depends. I mean, so they actually. Uh, a lot of the cucks uh, that I've, I've, you know, been able to work with scenes and stuff, they want to be up close and personable and they want to see like all the action going on. Wow. Um, they want to know that they're not satisfactory and this other person is satisfying their, their, you know, their Fair interest. So what, so what did you think of yes. him? Not my type. No, your type? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting date though. Yeah. Yeah, that was so fun. I wanted to make it funny. And that fun. was fun, though. It yeah. was enjoyable. We should, we should bring the next guy out then and yeah. see if it's more your type. Sure. More your speed. All right, let's sure. bring him out. Pr- I'm very picky, though. Welcome. Come on in. Perfect. All and right, so you're going to go on a little speed date here. Okay. Um, with the lovely blonde lady to your left. Hello. Nice Hi, to meet ladies. you. Nice to meet 
I'm Grant. You have three minutes on the clock. Okay. You know how this works, right? You ask anything. There's no rules. Oh, no it's rules. My first time. You so have three I'd... minutes. No rules. That's how it works. I've, I ask her. She doesn't. Anybody ask me. can ask anything. Okay, it's a free yeah, for all. Yeah. I thought I was the only one. Yeah, <laughs> no, everybody, 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 everybody can just ask whatever they like. No. All right, three minutes on the clock. Let's go. Okay, so um, this being my first time uh, asking you, what are what have you been looking for lately in this world with a guy? Well, I am very picky, I must say. Okay. So I don't go on dates often. Okay. But when I do, you should be very lucky. Okay. So what type of dates you you like uh you like going out to games restaurants? Well, it's like is it our first date? Like where would you For, take first, a girl? So well, let me ask you a question. Okay. Where would you take a girl out on a first date? I'm a big like sports person, so I like the hockey. Would you be down for hockey? Oh, like Golden Knights. Golden Knights. Yeah, that sounds fun. Golden okay. Knights. Yeah. Okay. A first date. That's a good first for, date. I feel not bad. You know. Because yeah. for people that have never been to a game, I always say go, you know, try it. It's better live. But, yeah, that's well, probably. I've been to a Golden Knights game before. I actually went to the Raiders game last night. That was, like, a lot of fun. Okay. Yeah. They did. Yeah, they won. I'm not really a Raiders fan, but. <laughs> go Raiders. I mean, my, my team's about to play, like, in an hour, the Bills. But we're we're in shambles right now. We are doing so bad. So, Yeah. I guess, yeah. Okay. Well, uh, how long have you been in Vegas? About six years. And you? Since I was three. So I've been oh. in here. Oh, oh wow. Whole, whole freaking life, pretty Why much. Why have you left? Oh, my gosh. So many questions <laughs> that I've been asking myself Why for years. Why are you stuck here? Why am I stuck here? Oh, it. man. Being the youngest, uh, I don't know. I mean, I, I liked it here. And everywhere around the world, it's like everywhere I go, they're like, oh, it's too expensive here. And I'm like, well, that's not really the problem, but. I mean, it seems like everyone's moving here now, especially since COVID. Well, I feel like Vegas is like very more affordable, like budget friendly, cheaper. And you can have like this beautiful house. Yeah. You know, compared to like California, you'll have like a small little house. You'll be, you'll be stuck. Yes. Yeah. You know. So I guess that's, that that's is a true. pro. Yeah. So, um, I have a question for yes. you. So where is, I guess, um, the most romantic place you've taken out a, a woman? Ooh, probably Roberto's 24 hour, you know. <laughs> That's terrible. Two, two that o'clock, is, what is Roberto's? Two o'clock, two o'clock, o'clock in the place? morning, carne asada <laughs> fries. Terrible. No, I'm just kidding. Next. Uh, probably, <laughs> mm, you know, I would probably say, well, ro romantic place. I mean, the girl that I've always been with, they like to eat. So I go to like oh. that Texas Day. I go to those Texas Day Brazil like oh. cookouts, you know, just oh, keep okay. that card flipped over. Here you go. Keep that meat coming, no homo. But, you know, that's, you know, that's what yeah. I usually go for. So, okay. what do, what, so what do you do for work? I'm bartender. So, oh. yeah. Oh, at, time is up. Oh, no. <laughs> My time is up. But, yeah, bartender at Candelabra. Let's so. do the, oh, the final okay. question from Alexis again. <laughs> Final she has the good questions. She has a fun question for you. Yes. Oh, the same question? <laughs> what is your favorite uh, dish that you can and like and enjoy to cook? Ooh, enjoy to cook. Favorite dish? I would probably say like a pesto <clears throat> pasta or a, a sun-dried tomato pasta. Oh, nice. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's what I usually like to do. Um, I can make a pretty good... Even just like a pretty good, like, uh, what is it? Like the cheese bread with like a pesto sauce on it. Like, yeah, I like Italian. Even though I'm not Italian, I really like, <laughs> I love that stuff. So, <laughs> so that's what I would say probably. All right. Yeah. All right. Well, cool. Thanks for coming through. Well, Thanks. thank you guys. Thank you. This is fun. Thank you. <laughs> thank thank you. you so much. I actually like sports. I like going to live sporting games. Oh, you do? Yes. So how, how would you think of him? I... I think he has like a great personality, um, but I'm very picky, so I I wouldn't go out with him. Oh, you wouldn't? No. What, what's what is it the personality or the looks that threw you off? No, it's just a variety of things. Oh, a variety <laughs> of things. <laughs> <laughs> a variety of things. Oh no. It was the 
most oh, like, no. polite way of saying <laughs> it something. It was a variety of things. <laughs> Jesus. That, that does not sound good for him. I'm very picky. The variety of things are wrong with that guy. <laughs> Maybe we should bring him back for another episode where you could critique him and help him get better, you know? We can <laughs> take him through the steps. I you know what it is? I'm not a big dater. I, mm. You know, I, I'm not a serial dater, and I know that there's people that just go on dates with whoever all the time, and they just enjoy that. I'm just, I'd rather be at home alone, comfy in my bed watching a movie. Are you a relationship kind of girl or more like single, ready to mingle? Kind of, kind of so girl. if you're going to date, mm. you want to like, you're looking for something that's going to like last. Or well, I'm looking for like a spark. Yeah, that makes you know? sense. And if there's no spark before, then. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Let's bring out the next one. Just keep these dates rolling. Yes. Come on through. Take a seat. Oh, I like the outfit. Yeah. Looking good. All right, so you're going to go on a little three-minute speed date here. Nothing's off limits. Ask any questions you like. How you guys doing? She's looking okay. for a future husband, so. <laughs> Are you ready? Not necessarily. Not necessarily, okay, so but potentially. Fast. Right. She's moving fast. I'm not moving fast. <laughs> it's the speed dating. You're going to speed dating to you haul in a minute. We're going to go straight from here down I'm to the chapel after. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. I'm wrong. Yeah. We got, we got yeah. Elvis on, on yeah, order. Yeah, the Elvis chapel. All right, three minutes on the clock. Let's go. All right. Hey, Ross, so what do you do in town? Uh, I do events. I'm pro like a big promoter. Okay. Like that. I what always do you, doing events. What clubs do you promote for? Uh, I do hip hop clubs. So right now I'm doing something at Joe Rose, uh, the Hookah Lounge, and I'm signing contracts right now to get something going on at this bar called Queen Bar. Okay. So um, where would you take, um, you know, a woman that you're interested in on a first date? Where do, you, where do you normally take them? I mean, I'm a pretty adventurous guy, but... I really like to do escape rooms. It kind of let me know where she at in the head. Is she a little oh, crazy or not? Cool. Or if she's smart, if she can get us out of a, a tight call or something. So what if she can't get you out? It's, it's a deal breaker? No, nah, it's not a deal breaker. As long as she put forth the effort, some girls be acting all timid and act like they don't want to, like, you know, like, just be smart here. Like... <laughs> I like that. That's like a ride or die type of thing. <laughs> no, it's it's not as intense as people make it. It's actually like a, a, a icebreaker. Like you get to you get a chance to talk to someone without being nervous about it. It's fun. You can touch a little bit, a little flirty, you know. So just it just sets a little vibe. So it's a little fun time. That's too serious. It's something that we could talk and discuss and see where so, we at. So me though, as a, a female and a woman, I think a lot of us don't like to be touched right away on the first date. Well, not technically like touching you inappropriately, but you no, know. but even like a tap. I'm okay. very, I don't like to be. T <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, but once I really like the guy, then I'm like full, like you know, full on, full yeah, on. I like. I mean, exceptions stuff. are made, you know, for everybody. So we can always have that one thing we don't like, and we can meet somebody that we never met before, and they can just turn it to a different yeah, you direction. Never know. You never right. know. What do you like to do on the first date? I like to keep it casual, just like dinner and drinks. Dinner just and drinks. because I can, they can sit across from me and I can see them and they don't touch me. And um, I can look at to their eyes and see what they're really all about, you know. And You like fancy places or you want to go to a dive bar? No, definitely not a dive no. bar. <laughs> <laughs> Do I look like a dive bar no, girl? Not at all, not at all. But sometimes, <laughs> you know, sometimes the chaos of the dive bar could be a good distraction for making it too personal. Oh no. <laughs> you know, sometimes, sometimes, sometimes you, you want you meeting someone and you just kind of you don't want to make it too. How about much. like Choka Madeira? That's like lively. That's, that's, that's very good. That's very good. Or Ching and um, you know, ramen. or somewhere just lively but nice. It doesn't have to be like Mastro's or Golden Steer, you know. What do you like to drink? I'm a champagne girl. Okay. A nice champagne. Okay. Bottle, girl. Champagne is a little. I'm expensive. A little strong for me. <laughs> nah, nothing's wrong with expensive. I I like champagne. I probably don't drink it too much because I drink I one glass of champagne and it just. <laughs> yes, it's it's not for guys. They don't really like champagne, yeah. which is fine. But I I, I ordered a bottle for you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, time is up. Let's see the oh. final question. <laughs> final question. Goodness gracious. <clears throat> Here we go. <laughs> I'm excited um, for the question. Um, what is your top fetish? Feet. Ooh. All right. Okay. You are solid on that. Okay. Nice. <laughs> what is it about the feet that you like the most? Uh, just some pretty feet. Nice color on it. You know? Yeah, do you like her feet? How are they looking? Oh, they're Ooh, looking yeah. nice. Oh, yeah. They got the color on it. A little glittery. I'll yeah. put them in my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> People do like my feet. Yes. Nice. I like that. At least we, we have a wants. foot connection. Yeah. <laughs> connection. <laughs> well, thanks for coming through. We'll let you know. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I think that went pretty good. Yeah, he's really nice. Yeah. He was attracted yeah. to your feet. That's a plus. It's a good yeah. start. Yeah. Are you into that? Thing? Um, you know, I am into it. If I'm into the guy, Fair like, enough. I like them actually being obsessed with me. Yeah. Yes. I could see that. It starts with your feet. It like starts a foot with massage. My feet. Yes. Ooh. Yes. Dude, I'll I, take that. Any I'm day. all about the foreplay. <laughs> I'm like, make that your first date. Yeah. Oh, I know, right? <laughs> A little foot massage. Little foot I massage? think that'll be like a good second date. Would you mm. let him suck on your toes? On the second date? No. <laughs> well, <laughs> maybe well, eventually. You know maybe it maybe well, eventually. Well, maybe if I have some champagne and I really like him. <laughs> You're and like, I'm, go ahead, baby, go. <laughs> yeah. In my Crocs, by the way. That's you have such great toes. <laughs> no, they'll be in these. And, you know, I'll put some purple. I smell good anyway. Freshly <laughs> showered. Are you ready for the final date? Yes, All let's right. do it. Hopefully he's a winner. I'm really picky. I think the last guy's got some potential there. Yeah, I think the last guy. Yeah, I think he was on the, I, I think, think he was I'm vibing with you. I'm on a second date with my Bumble guy. <laughs> 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 All right, let's bring out the final guy. Okay. All right, come in, okay. come in. Oh, take a seat. Fourth one. Okay. How you doing? Oh my God, you good? Good, uh, how are you doing? Yeah. Good, man. I'm all just we, have a, we have an Australian. Hey, I'm Jack. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice oh to meet you, you just got to hold that microphone there. Yeah. All right. Hey, I'm Hi. Jack. Nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you. Have you ever been on a speed date before? Oh, mate, first time, so let's do it. All right, sick. Three minutes on the clock. You can ask any questions. I'm Jack. Jack, nice to meet you. All right. Well, Jack, so how long have you been in Vegas? Eight months. Oh, yeah. and you are from Australia? Yeah, I'm from Perth, Australia, but, like, I moved here. Like, I'm in a show on the Strip. Anyway, what do you do? I'm Absent? interested. I have no are idea you who you are Are you a dancer? Either. Yeah, like, I do dancing and flips and stuff like that. Yeah, I was feeling yeah. ar acrobatic vibes. From you. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, I do flips and that, yeah. That's oh, my, cool. My <laughs> Are you a fire sign? Leo, Sagittarius? Oh, oh, I think I'm a Capricorn. Like, I'm born in January. Oh, really? Yeah. You're very high energy for Capricorn. Thank you. Which thank is a you. good thing, it's not bad. Yeah, yeah. I feel like it's a combination of caffeine and nicotine. Oh. There, there <laughs> <you go. laughs> that means I have a high go. energy. <laughs> Maybe that explains it. I love music. What's your favorite um, artist? Maybe like, I like Kanye. Like old Kanye, like okay. his first few albums. So you bump Kanye all day long in the car? Probably not all day. day. No, not all day, but okay. sometimes. What about you? I like, um, I'm variety. I like house music and rock music. I like to mix it up. But actually like, one, have, do you like Taylor variety. Swift? I love Taylor Swift actually. Because that's the thing I, I've realized when I'm I hang out with girls, you put on Taylor Swift, they love that. They really identify with Taylor Swift. Yeah. Get them talking about Travis Kelsey. Like, He's hot. You know what I mean? That's like, yes. <laughs> Can we have him on the show? Yeah, <laughs> I think he's taken. <laughs> Darn. So, so what's the appeal between like Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift? Why do like American women latch onto that so much? Um, I like them separately. Okay. It's just really cute that they are together. I mean, it's an odd couple, I feel. Um, but I loved Taylor from a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. And you know, Travis is just always nice, easy on the eyes, so. Yeah, yeah, of course. Good, good moustache. Yes. So where would you take your first date? Like, where do you take girls on the first date? I try not to set a precedent that I'm going to be the guy that's going to, like, buy you heaps of shit. Right? So, like, I try and do something like, I take girls to shows in Vegas. You know what I mean? Okay. So I'll buy tickets to the show. Because, like, if you take them to Nobu or something, like, it's, you know, so okay. or a show. Or, like, sometimes I take girls ice skating because if they can't ice skate, I'm, like, you're a little, Sorry, you're a little uncoordinated. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, <laughs> ice skating. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So what's like your um? What's like the craziest oh. sexual Cuba. thing you've done before? Um. Fuck. Right into the camera. Like when I was on tour, like I had a threesome for the first time with two girls, but like I could tell both these girls they were like stoked to fuck me. Oh, really? Oh, that's fun. Yeah, that was yeah. what was cool about it. Like, I could tell when, both these girls, they were like, right. Yeah. When everyone in the party's all excited about it, I think that's like really fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was like, that was the cool part. Yeah, for sure. Awesome. All right, let's do awesome. like final question from Alexis. Ah, so you've been here for eight months here in Vegas. Nice and fresh. Nice and fresh. Um, what's your body count for these last eight months? Ooh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Do you have a piece of paper? <laughs> <laughs> Do some quick math. Are, is it tissue to cry or to write something? <laughs> 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 
sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> sorry, ask me that again. <laughs> What's your body count over the last? No, 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 no. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I guess that's no luck so far. <laughs> <laughs> All right, who, who are we feeling to bring out for the final head-to-head? Out, head? out of the four, um, just because he's... He's very nervous. I know, I like Does that turn you on a little bit? Nervous, yeah. yeah. Make it more, make more nervous. Make are you like a little, like, you like, you know, a man-eater kind of a, a lady, like playing with the youngins? Um, hello, I think I'm younger than him. <laughs> <laughs> Henry had very young energy. How old do you think he too. was? He was like 20, do you reckon 22? Really? Yeah. He's like a baby. Oh, I thought he was like 30. No. <laughs> no. No way. No way. No way well, was he 30. Well, we're going to play with the baby today. Okay, we're going to play with the baby. <laughs> so it gives me one. Okay. And then, and then who are the other ones? We You're the escape room guy. You had the guy that didn't, that didn't know what the chair was for in the yeah. hotel room. I think the footman. Maybe he could test it out on the massage. On the feet and see who gives the better massage. Oh, oh that's good. That's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, but put him to the test. Put him yeah. to the test. Yeah, we'll put a, we'll do a foot Alice massage test. I can always give yeah, him my yeah. foot. Yeah. <laughs> How about can we give him both of our feet and we're both going to be the judges? Okay, you if, you, if I do it, you're going to do it too. Yeah, perfect. Is that okay? Yeah, okay, it's perfect. perfect. So we're going to bring out okay. the last two guys for the final head to head. Woohoo. All right, so you guys are going to have to share a microphone, unfortunately. Oh, so it's both of them at the same <laughs> two time. Two guys, one yes, mic. Yes. <laughs> two guys, one mic, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, two guys. So you guys have to share it. Two at the same time. All right, time. Two, one. Two, so just, two guys, one mic. Just make sure okay. when you guys are talking, we're you're talking into the mic. folks. <laughs> Five minutes on the clock. You guys can ask any questions you like. It goes all around, and let's get straight into it. Do you want to help me with first question? Let's not break the iceberg. <laughs> For sure. Um, describe um, cream pie. What's a cream pie to you guys? Oh. It's when I'm fucking a girl so good mm. that she just keep creaming on my dick. Oh, okay. That's your yeah, definition. If she's on birth control, then yeah, run it. But <laughs> <laughs> then run it. He's uh -huh. like, oh, you're, you're dumping loads. <laughs> Oh, wow. We know who the frisky one is. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, well, I, yes. We asked him what his body count is. What's your body count for the past six months? Like. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I can't plead the fit on that uh, question. We got some Why are you both here? blushing? <laughs> your face is so red still from that question. <laughs> uh, Maybe about 10. I'm single, by the way. Ready to mingle. Single and mingling. Yeah, and mingling. <laughs> on every Definitely first mingling. date. Active mingler. <laughs> on the first date, he's actively mingling. <laughs> All right, sweet. So you've asked us what our body counts are. Ladies, what are your body counts? <laughs> I think that's For the last valid. six months. <laughs> what, mine in the last six months? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um... That's a little difficult to calculate considering no, no, it's, it's my this job. Is a safe space. <laughs> Trust me, this is a safe this space. Is so like, funny. Yeah, so this, whatever you say is just staying between us. I'm going to allow you to answer that one. Oh, me? <laughs> yes, you're the one on the date. Um, you know, I can count him on one hand. <laughs> count only the ones that made you come. Five or less. <laughs> count all the ones that made oh, you come. Probably one. <laughs> good, good answer. Yes. How exactly. do you know you're attracted to a guy? I'm very picky. I'm a tough cookie. I really am. So what, what so, turns that spark on for you? You know, it's everything. It's um, just all the above. Just mm. all the above. How about you guys? When I know I just want to look at her, would I really... Lick her hair? No, I look at her. Oh, look, look at, at her, her when I just oh. want to look at you and just... <laughs> and just be in your presence. I know I, it reached yeah. something else for me. That's when it's like, oh, yo, I'm feeling her. Have you ever been cheated on? Cheated on? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think a lot of girls have been cheated on, unfortunately. How would you find out, like, if there's one? That I am an FBI agent. That's my other job, <laughs> <Yeah>. CIA. <laughs> I think all of us women are. Have you ever point. cheated? Have No, I actually haven't. Not when I'm in a committed relationship. I don't believe and cheating. I think if you want to have fun, it should be mutual. Like, oh, let's have fun with the third party or, 
you know, it should be talked about. That's not cheating. Um, or if you just don't want to be with that person, you want to explore other people, you should let that person know. Definitely. You know? But unfortunately, a lot of guys just don't do that. Are you into inviting the third party into the bedroom? If I'm in a serious relationship with someone and I feel like they've earned it. Okay, it's definitely something that you have to earn. Yes, for sure. How long do you think it would take if they, if they wanted that? <laughs> <laughs> He's no. like, how many dates in are we? Uh... <laughs> no, no. Oh, no, no at no, least no, no, a year. Like how long do I have to be good for before I get rewarded? <laughs> one year, <laughs> one year. Yeah, they can't just earn. Yeah, that's like, no. You like girl on girl action? Girl on girl's fun, yes. I think girls are prettier than boys. I think that's <laughs> obvious. <laughs> what yeah. about like? Do There's you a lot more hotter girls than boys. Yeah. Yeah. I was uh, just going to ask you, do you prefer to be more dominant or like submissive in the bedroom? I like both. But normally if I'm like, like I'm in love with a guy, I like to be submissive. But in the beginning, I like to do both. Yes. How about you guys? I'm a dominant person, definitely. I'd, I'd say the same, yeah. I don't really like you guys to be are both like right. that submissive. So, yeah. so where's um, the most romantic place you guys have? Or like, what's like your fantasy date? Actually, that's a better question. Um, I'm, I'm kind of like adventurous. So I would love to do something in the sky somewhere, somewhere like private jet, just... Traveling across the skies, having a day, getting to know each other, going to a different destination, just having a good time in the air, honestly. I think that would be so, cool so good. Fantasy day. That's a good one. <clears throat> Damn. <laughs> maybe like, I don't know, like some, some cool beach maybe, like in Australia. I, yeah, like, like I like to surf. Yeah, maybe like that, okay. something like that. Yeah. Time, time is up, so let's do one final question <laughs> from Alexis. <laughs> you know what? I think, I think she had one. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot one. No, yeah, yeah. I think you guys, you had that special yeah, final I, question, I, right? I think, I, I think a nice, uh, you know, deciding factor would be, uh, I think, a little, uh, a little sample of the massage the feet. Would you, yes. that do, would you do that for your lady? Yes, of course. All right. Well, yeah. if you... If I do it, I feel like you have to do it with me, Alexis. And I'll put my foot actually, up. both of our feet in the one guy's hand at the same time. Oh, okay. It's a little sweaty. I had a sock on. So as long as she ready? does it, I normally Who don't do it? this. Who wants this? Well, we're, we're Who wants a piece together. of this action right here? <laughs> it's a foot <laughs> massage off. Yeah, leave that on. We'll just do it. Like, you gotta <laughs> do it foot massage off. It's great. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. Okay, it has really soft hands. This is actually feeling really good. We're both going to judge together. My pants are so proud. Let's do it. All right. Oh, oh. Wait, just just ow, get right ow, in there. Oh, he's going to wait. Oh, wait. No. That's I'm hurting me, babe. No, that's no. hurting me. Oh, oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm a gentle flower. I'm a gentle flower. Yeah, but you've got uncomfortable shoes. You need to release. <laughs> need to you need to release the tension. I mean, that could be a positive. He's like a chiropractor for the foot. Wow. I wasn't prepared for that. <laughs> I kind of feel. I kind of feel that you may love to the foot, and yeah. I. I he was um, that. solving problems. You yeah. came in like a wrecking ball, <laughs> swinging in. It was like shark. I'm going to bridge that open. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So who's it going to be? Who are you going to pick? Out of, out of the two, you have to pick. I have to. Pick. Yeah, you have yeah, to pick the winner. Pick one winner. Okay. Um, just because he gave the better foot massage. <laughs> That's right. I'm going to take it personal. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna take it personal. You know, I'm like, I don't want to be attacked. <laughs> oh my god, stop. Oh my god, don't put that on me. Relax. <laughs> okay, like so we have a winner. This has been Shoot Your Show with Thompson, and we'll see you guys next time. <laughs> All right, cool.